there have been so many releases this week. Like, how are we supposed to keep up? This is this is to the film industry. How are we supposed to keep up? Hey guys, welcome back to the podcast. Today we're doing another trailer reaction. I am reacting to the new Venom trailer that literally just dropped, I want to say like a couple days ago. I wanted to jump on this because there's just been so much going on this week with music and film and I'm like, okay, I gotta, I gotta get a reaction going. So that's what we're doing today. Now, just to preface this, I have not seen the second Venom, so there might be some things that they're showing in here or that's connected to the second one that I won't understand yet. And I know you're probably like, girl, why are you watching the trailer for the third one if you haven't seen the second one? But I plan on watching the second one. I promise I will. I don't know if I'll film a reaction for it, but I'll definitely watch the second one before this one comes out. So it's fine. Like, I'll be all caught up by the time this one comes out. I actually did a full reaction to the first Venom and it's on my channel. I'll link it somewhere on here so that way you guys can go and see if you haven't seen it. You can go watch it after this video. Um, this I had to split it up in like two parts because YouTube was being really weird about copyright and it was, it was hard to upload, okay? So please go and watch it if you haven't watched it and give it a thumbs up. It's on my channel. It's available for you guys to go watch. Um, so just to kind of recap, I guess for really for myself, because I'm sure most people kind of already know uh, what's been going on in the Venom franchise. So apparently this is the last one. Uh, it's called Venom The Last Dance. So I guess this is the last in the franchise. From what I remember of the first one, how it ended was that Michelle Williams character, I think her name is Anne or something like that. She was talking to Eddie and then she assumed that Venom had died. So she thought that they pretty much made it look like Venom sacrificed himself to save Eddie. And that's kind of the way they made it look. And then at the very end, it was revealed that um, Venom is still alive and he's still attached to Eddie. And then there was some like weird end credit scene with like Woody Harrelson. I don't know what his character is, if he's supposed to be like a psycho or something like that. I don't know. He was in prison and he was having a conversation with Eddie. Um I'm pretty sure like he's the villain in the second one, but again, I have not seen it, so I don't know. Do not spoil it for me in the comments. I will watch the second one. I just um, I just haven't gotten around to it. This this has been a lot going on. This has been so much stuff coming out. I'm trying to get more content out for you guys. You know how it goes. But anyway, so that's what I remember from the last one. I, I'm pretty sure Drake got killed in the, not Drake the rapper, Drake the villain in the first one. So I think he's gone. Um, I hope he doesn't pop back up in the second one because I did not like his character. But yeah, so that that's pretty much, I feel like, what, what I remember and how it left off. So again, they're probably going to be showing stuff that's connected to the second one. I'm assuming that this third one is picking back up where they left off in the second one. So might be a little confusing for me, but that's okay. I'm still going to react to it and I'll give you my thoughts afterwards. Um, yeah. But before I do that, make sure you subscribe to my channel so that way you don't miss out when I upload. Summer is just around the corner. So that means like festival season is coming up. I'm, I, I plan on having plenty of interviews coming out. So I'm really excited and looking forward to that. And I don't want you guys to miss out. And be sure to leave a thumbs up if you like this video and leave a comment. Let me know what your favorite Venom movie is between the first two. And maybe if there's any anything I should really look out for in the second one, like something that I should really pay attention to that will kind of foreshadow maybe what will happen in this third one. Let me know. You should probably know that I have a really dark and unpredictable side to me. Stop speaking. I'm giving you a chance, sweetie. <laughs> Say what? <Sweetie. Oil. gasps> Would you have to set up? I already know it. What? Are you we are. Venom! No. Oh. Yeah, we. We are. They're out of space. Oh, dang. He you took off all, to all the finest places. I need to tie up most. Wait, let me pause, y'all, because Venom is actually really funny. Like, I mean, Eddie is funny too, like Eddie as himself, but I don't know. I guess because 
going into the first one, I kind of thought it was going to be a little scary. I knew it was more so action because um, Venom is a part of the Marvel universe, but I was, I don't know why, maybe because of the way the trailer was shown, like when the first one came out and the way everybody was like talking about it, I thought it was going to be kind of scary a little bit, but Venom was actually pretty funny. Like for him to be like an alien or some type of extraterrestrial thing, entity, whatever, like he actually, <laughs> he's actually pretty funny. I'm not going to lie. It's our job to make sure that remains a secret. Let's go get him. Oh, shit! We are fugitives. On the run. In the shit. We are living the dream, my friend. You mean it? No! Lady This is chess! Hello! Hi. <laughs> there has to be a reason they're after us. Eddie, my own, has found us. Oh, shit. Jesus Christ! The heck is that? There's an army coming that cannot be beaten. As long as Adam lives, everyone. Everything will end. We may not make it out of this alive, buddy. Eddie, the time has come. Be honest with me. How fast do you think you can get that thing to go without killing it? Only one way to find out! <laughs> Whoa. that's crazy wow okay so okay so let's talk about it it's gonna be super action-packed um i'm sure it'll probably be like double the action compared to the first one um so I guess immediately what I was thinking about was like, because this is called The Last Dance and this is supposed to be the final movie in the franchise, at least that's what I've heard. I don't know. You guys correct me if I'm wrong. Um, I'm wondering if like, I don't think Eddie's going to die, but I'm wondering how how that's going to end between uh, Venom and Eddie is, is Venom going to be able to like go back to where he came from? Um is he going to die? Like, is Eddie just going to have to like live without him for the rest of his life? Or is there going to be a way for them to like still communicate or still be a part of each other without, I guess like without Eddie being hunted all the time. Cause I feel like as long as, as long as he's connected to Venom, people are going to be after him, right. Or the government's going to be after him. So um, I'm, I'm curious to see how that's going to end. I don't know what the story is like in the comics or what's, what's Canon. I don't know. Um, but specifically, I guess for the movie, I wonder how they're going to, I wonder how they're going to wrap up the story, basically. I'm, uh, I'm looking forward to this movie. I'm super late getting into this franchise. I, I, of course, I, like, seen it when it, um, seen, like, the trailer or seen, like, people talking about it when it first came out, but it just wasn't, sometimes movies or music or whatever is just not on your radar at the time, and then later on you discover it and you're like, oh, wow, like, where was I at when this came out? Like, why didn't I watch this? Or why didn't I get off into this before? But anyway, I feel like now that I have a podcast and I have this platform to be able to talk about films and TV, I think it's kind of, like, pushing me to watch more stuff, like, things that, you know, maybe came out a few years ago that I just ne never got around to watching or just it just wasn't on my radar or maybe I wasn't interested in it at the time and then now I am. I don't know. So that's the kind of cool part about like doing podcasts about films and stuff because it's like kind of forces me to watch films that I probably wouldn't have watched otherwise. But anyway, you guys let me know in the comments what you thought about that. Like what did you think about the trailer when you first seen it? And um you know, I do plan on going to see it in theaters. It looks like it's going to be out in October. So have a little bit to prep for it. But I know <sighs> there's so many movies coming out, you guys. This, like, we're halfway through the year, but there's still so many releases that are going to be coming out. Like, and I'm talking, like, you know, some heavy hitters. Um, so it's going to be a lot to try to keep up with. <laughs> 
So if there are films or TV series that you want me to react to or that you want me to discuss that I have not mentioned yet or something that you want me to continue, please let me know in the comments because sometimes this is a lot to try to like keep up with everything. I'm never going to be able to keep up with everything new that drops. I really just kind of focus on the things that I'm interested in and then obviously like what you guys request. So y'all y'all gotta let me know what you want to see from me yeah thank you so much for watching i appreciate all of the views the likes the comments and of course to my new subscribers thank you so much i really appreciate it um i hope that you guys are enjoying my content because i plan on putting out some more you know i try to upload once a week if not once a week then every other week but i, I really want to get into the groove of uploading once a week so um be on the lookout for a new episode next week and like i said i do plan on doing more interviews so i will have those dropping i feel like pretty soon and i just gotta get my life together you know we just, we just gotta get our lives together you know how that goes. But anyway, again, thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys next week. Bye.